Coach. Coach, we would need you to sit down here. Take another chair. They'll slide on in. All right, we're joined here with Liberty Hill High School head coach Kent Walker. Coach, if you'll introduce your four student athletes. Yeah, number 17, Lloyd Johnson. Number nine, Casey Herman. Number 10, Andy Thomas. And number three, Aaron Brewer. Coach, if you'll start us off, just your thoughts about today's game. Uh, you know, we, we just made too many mistakes. Um, you know, start the game, we go down, and, and uh, we've got a fourth and two or three, and we jump and, and uh, try to come out, kick a field goal, and miss it. And, uh, you know, that kind of that hurt us, and that kind of set the tone a little bit early. And then we were able to tie it back up, 14-14, going into halftime. And then, uh, you know, we were able to play pretty good defensively um, on the way down. And, and uh, you know, they, they, they got a field goal on us, and um, we got the ball back. And, you know, we tried to – Tried to got a got a fake punt, got it, got the yardage, and uh, got a holding penalty, and then uh, you know then then uh, you know tried another fake punt just because we knew we, we needed to try to keep the ball there, and and that's probably my fault. We probably should have, I mean hindsight, but probably should have uh, punted the ball deep and, and made them earn it. But uh, um, you know I, I'm proud of these kids. They they, they fought their tail offs today, so uh, it just. Uh, I, I can't say enough about our kids and, and our, our community. They showed out today, and, I, and I'm, I'm very grateful for that. Questions from the floor. Coach, offensively, uh, what did they do defensively that was so tough to get your offense going, especially it's, in that They're definitely the fastest defense we've seen, and then they're so big up front. Um, it made it very difficult for us to move them. Um, so, I just, you know, that's, that's the best defense we've seen all year. What are your emotions? Look like you were. I don't know if it was second guessing yourself or just it hitting you, but it looked like you were really. You hitting. always second guess yourself. Their first touchdown, I, I feel like I called the wrong play defensively, you know, so when they scored. So, uh, you know, I, I called the wrong coverage. I should have left safety in the middle of the field. You know, you, you, you play those games, and I mean, I've played them since, you know, the, the end of the game. You know, there's, there's a lot of things um, that I that, uh, felt like we did that we could have done a little bit differently here and there. Coach, you touched on it, I think, a minute ago, but the fake punt down, down there at the end, what. Um, Given you know where it was on the field at the time again, what what was it that gave you confidence that that was the right call? Um, you know, we just felt like you know that that, that we could sneak him sneak him out, and um, and we got him out. It was one on one, and uh, felt like we still kind of we had a good ball thrown on it, and uh, you know it just yeah, it, it, kid made our kid made a great play. Probably should have um, talk a little bit about um, please how athletic the offense was that you guys faced today compared to the teams you've been playing so far in the playoffs. Uh, yeah, I mean, it obviously presented a great challenge. I mean, they were really athletic, really fast. But, um, you know, props to them. They executed well on offense, and they had really great athletes. So. And what's going through your mind after after this loss? You're one of the leaders of this team, and to see it come so close against the ball. Uh, yeah, I mean, it hurts. And I know it hurts all of us. It hurts the whole team. And, uh, you know, I just, I don't know. I mean, I'm sorry we couldn't finish it, but, um, you know, it's the way it goes. You know, it, it just hurts a lot. Lloyd, at the beginning of the season, I mean, your offense was all new. Your defense was veteran. Um, any kind of surprise that you guys made another run to state? Uh, no, sir, not at all. I mean, obviously, uh, 11 new starters, uh, they had to get going some way. It just took time, uh, all new people. So, But they definitely pulled through this whole season. Proud of them. Can you guys maybe talk? There was quite a lot of people in gold in the stands, uh, coach or in the players. Talk about what it was like to see that kind of support there. I don't want to speak for them, but I, I mean, I looked up at one point and I thought, man, that, that, what, what a community. Um, what a special place for us to be, Liberty Hill. Um, the support these guys got is it's amazing. Um, but, but the hard work they put in, they also deserve it, in my opinion. Um, 42,000, yeah, pretty good. Um, and on, uh, you've got another chapter of your life coming up uh, with the Army. Uh, what are you going to remember most about this chapter of your life, the high uh, school? I mean, uh, this season, I mean, just the the brotherhood, you know, these three, the whole team. It's just I've never been a part of something like that. That's truly a family, and um, I know that you know whatever I need, they'll be there for me. And um, yeah, so just just having this this family, the second family, it's and the rest being really close, it, it means a lot to me. The pass that you threw on the punt, did you think it was there at the time, or did you think, oh? Um, I saw him one-on-one, so I just threw it up, I mean, hoping that he would make a play. But their def the defensive player made a good play, so. Coach, 
Sometimes when you look back on the season, what will you remember most? This senior class. Um, it's a special group um, I, for obvious reasons. I mean, I know most of y'all know what they've been through and what we've been through over the past year. And uh, it's just a special group to me. Um, defensively, that we had a bunch of starters back this year. And, and, and um, I can't thank them enough um, for, for the support they've given me. And, uh, and uh, just awesome group, awesome group of young men. What's the hurt like you're feeling out there? I mean, it, it hurts, but I know tomorrow Coach Walker's going back to the drawing board. So they're, they're coming back, and it's not going to be that long. So that's kind of where my mind goes to is that I just want to get back in there. Uh, I know I won't be coming back, but I'll just be coming and working. And it sucks right now, but it's, it's what you got to go through facing a good team like that. So.